All right, so we just got a new toy delivered. Uh, but first, before we bring it in the house, we have to clear all of this stuff out of the way to make room for it. Their lift gate was broken, so she had to pitch everything into the front yard and uh, do it the hard way, so. The Uline six foot packing and shipping station. Model number H7631 is 72 inches of the highest quality shipping station your money can buy. 1200 pound weight capacity, all sorts of modules and stuff you can add, partitions, shelves, buckets, roll reels, uh, paper slicers, fans, laptop stations, monitors. This is a Lego toy for grownups. This has been on our list for a very, very long time, but we haven't had the need for it yet. We've just been doing everything on these plastic card tables to ship and fulfill our boards, even an ironing table. Finally, we've got enough revenue, we're shipping things often enough that it's time to upgrade the shipping station. The footage you just saw was from yesterday when we took delivery on it. It is now today and we are finishing its assembly because yesterday we were tired and we ran out of steam. So we're going to finish that. But first, we've got a new stud stack member from Ogden, Utah. Yay! So if that's you, I'm not going to ruin your identity and stuff. But if that's you, your card's coming in the mail today. Well, by the time you see it, it'll probably already be there. But you, whatever. Here's There's your card. This is your card. <laughs> If you'd like to join the stud stack, you can join over, what now, 115 people now? I'm actually on there right now.
And there's pre-drilled holes for another type of tabletop, but not this one. The most popular one that sold out. They, you can only order one of these per day because they're so backordered. They couldn't pre-drill But they holes. couldn't pre-drill the holes we need. <laughs> Start a business in your house, they said. It'll be great, they said. You won't have particle board crammed into your living room rug. Never. Can you go get safety glasses? Stuff's gonna fall right in my eyeball. I guess. Hi, Barry. You gonna help? Of course not. No. Barry wants to do the first one. Here's your glasses, bud. Oh. Well, see, Perry's not down for safety. You can't work here, bud. It's just particle board. I just don't want to strip them out. Because then once the screws go, wee all by themselves, then it's not really doing anything. How's that I, I still got stuff in my eyes. Safety glasses don't work. <laughs> Take your safety back to communist Russia. What are you laughing at? Just do it again. What are you doing? Ah! That was almost my eye. Give me those safety glasses back. We will never have to trip over this in the floor ever again. Look at this! Okay, that needs some work, but yes! I just love getting upgrades like this. Yes. Uh, so this is our new and improved shipping and fulfillment station. It's a real actual shipping and fulfillment station, not a card table and stuff. We say all the time in the stud stack, we tell guys, you need to start doing it ugly. Do it mm -hmm. ugly, do it dirty the first time. And then as you commit to that process in your business, then you can do it nicely, but at least you know there's cash flow there. So mm -hmm. there was enough cash flow and we realized we we're wasting enough time with our old rickety setup that it was worth it to upgrade the whole shipping and fulfillment station. We're gonna Absolutely. be so much faster now. All right, so we'll just take you on a tour of the new place. So board inventory is still on this little cart as always. It's just, it's further up into the corner so it, we don't trip on it when we go around the side of the couch. That was a big complaint. Basically this whole, the impetus of this whole thing is we finally tripped over this thing for like the thousandth time this is our paper reel where we store paper to wrap the boards in and we just tripped over this one too many times said one too many bad words and had one too many bruises on our ankles and we finally decided okay we're just going to get the shipping station get this up off the ground and I, what's the word i'm looking for like 
consolidate everything down into one table because this can hold a lot more than your standard card table. But we got extra boxes and stuff. We've still got finish and things that need to be stored indoors down in the corner, but it just takes up so much less space because it's it's neatly stacked and organized. So Jenny wanted to wait until we got in the commercial space to get this, but I, we don't know, we don't have a rigid timeline on that yet, and I just, I was tired of tripping over stuff. If we were gonna get it anyway, we might as well get it now and enjoy it a little bit, so. The top is where we have our shipping boxes, uh, packaging, mailing stuff, just grab and go, like lightweight stuff, because it's high up. Um, then we got our nice paper reel, but then the best part are these bucket rails. So this is just one size of bucket. We, we can get some that are a little bigger than this, but these are great to start out with. Basically everything we use in our packaging gets to go in a little bucket. So it's up off the table. It's not on a shelf falling through the, the things. Oh, and the best part, you can pick them up and stuff falls out of them. And you can take it with you. We also have all our little cards and pamphlets that go in the boxes. We get our stickers to seal up the paper and then everything is off the table. There's so much room for activities on this table. I'm so happy. I feel like I'm at a doctor's office with these stickers. Does anybody else like, is this how you got your stickers growing up from the doctor? They're just on these rolls we in almost need, these exact bins. We should definitely get a roll of Spider-Man stickers and just have stickers. Maybe that'll be a perk. Come work for us and we'll have Spider-Man stickers for you. If you come work for us, I promise you, if you want one, I will get you a Spider-Man sticker. <laughs> but only if you're good and don't cry on your first day. <laughs> <laughs> and then down here, you, it's kind of hard to see, but there's like this whole shelf goes all the way back. So if we ever want to store boxes, I've just got some tools and stuff there, but um, yeah, extra storage right here because sometimes you just need wide, flat storage underneath your tabletop. And then down here we got our crinkle paper, we got charcuterie board storage, we got trash can and some other stuff. Anyway, and then there's some room underneath for our larger boxes. This is just such a nice upgrade and we're so thankful for it. It's really gonna help us. It, it, it looks better. I, I don't know. I think it looks a lot better than the shenanigans it's we had before. It stresses me out less, that's for sure, because before you had to go all the way to the left side to get paper, but the scissors were on the right side and the boxes were over here, and now it's all in one spot, and I'm not stressed out to do like eight boards at a time. And then over here, we got another little tiny card table from Walmart again, and uh, that's where the laptop goes for the laser. It's just a nicer place to work. Um, it's not on the edge of another table. It's not, it's just, it's nice. It's just, we have room. There's more room behind the couch now. We're not tripping over stuff in the corners. It's just, it's very nice. What's your favorite part? Probably that I have so much more open table space and the bins right above everything combined because it is frustrating to like, fold the paper shut, but the stickers aren't right next to you. You're, they're behind you and on the right. Oh, that's right. Well, we had the ironing board set up behind the couch. So I'd be folding paper here on the boards, but then the stickers were back behind me. So I'm like, dang it. Now I had to open it back up, go get a sticker. But now I can just be doing it here, fold it shut, peel it off, boom, done. No unnecessary moving or, you know, ending the process early and just, yeah. So subscribe and you're gonna see us put this new shipping station through its paces. That's gonna be an upcoming video. We're gonna be fulfilling a lot of boards and we're gonna see how much faster this whole process is. So subscribe, hit the like button, share this video with your friends. We're just two idiots in Houston trying to start a furniture business and uh, it's going well so far. So thanks for hanging out with us and we'll catch you on the next one. Ask me how I do it, I just stick to the plan.